race car driver, sex symbol of Mexico, <laughs> broadcasting legend. We're going to talk about Pato TV here. And because I want to focus in on you, and since I have no one else to work the camera, I'm going to step around and ask you some dumb questions. All right, let's do it. Tell me about Pato TV. What is it? it? Is it an idea? Is it a real thing? Is it something in your mind? What is it? Pato TV to the moon, baby. It's uh, Pato TV is real. Um, it started as an idea, uh, and I gotta give props to my to my papa. Papa Pato was was truly the one that 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 brought it to life together with uh, together with IndyCar. You know, and this is all happening because um, you know we're not the only ones that that are trying to make it happen, you know. Um, for us, it was really important to put something in front of um, my country, and I really wanted to give it to them um, for free. I mean, I, I wanted them to be able to, to, to truly enjoy the championship as, as much as I have, and, um, and I feel like the series has so much potential. And just like in the past, I mean, you, you see what it was with Adrian Fernandez, Mario Dominguez, uh, Michel Jodain. Um, and I'm really hoping it, get, it gets back to that because I feel like there is no series similar to IndyCar. I mean, it's so competitive, it's, it's so different and unique. Um, and I feel like there, there is so much to, to really, truly enjoy when you're watching it. And we're filming this here intentionally with people walking behind you, with fans here, because there's life, there's excitement about where this championship is going with you as the leader, as crazy as that is. Yeah. I mean, this is all kind of the stepping stones into a bigger plan that uh, truly in the future I'd love to have a Mexican race. Um, like I said before, it would be a sold out event. Um, I think it would be the best event in the calendar because there's there's a good circuit that we can do it at. Um, it can host a lot of people, and and the fans, the energy of the fans are awesome. So I think um, you know what what we're doing. I think is definitely in the, in the right direction. And uh, and yeah, we're I'm continuing to, to work together with IndyCar, and, and you know these last three races are going to be on Multimedios, um, national TV, so everybody in Mexico can watch on open air. Um, but it'd be great to have the, the whole series on there for, for next year. So let's tell folks where they can find Pato TV. This is streaming, right? And so with, as you just mentioned with the uh, the broadcast element just added, that's amazing, but that's not overriding what you're doing as well. Where can they find what you're so doing? Pato TV, um, unfortunately to all my American friends, you can't watch. You have Whatever. To, you have to be in Mexico to Whatever to watch. award. Um, but Pato TV, you just go pato.tv and uh, it'll take you to to, to the Pato TV kind of um, joy center. Joy center. And you can watch Jeez. you can watch uh, practices, qualifying, and the race. But the race is only my onboard camera with telemetry uh, and radio coverage. What do you mean only? That might actually be the most exciting thing to watch yeah, with so you being sideways the whole everything. time. So now that we actually have it on open air TV, the races as well. So it's. So now we now we now we've got all of them. Um, I'm, I'm I'm really excited, man. I, this is something that has been like in the back of our minds for a while, and it's really cool to, to have it come into fruition. And I'm fighting a championship, so I don't know how much more I can be doing <laughs> to truly make this happen. <laughs> and you make like ten thousand dollars per stream every time someone logs on, right? Oh, You're making millions off this, I right, wish. Award? I wish. Kind of. <laughs> Kind of like uh, what, what's what's that site called that? that uh, Don't say OnlyFans. Oh. <laughs> Don't say OnlyFans. Pato OnlyFans. Okay. Oh. No, I'm just kidding. I right. mean, I mean, I'm doing this because I like my country. I love I love my people, and I I want them to be able to enjoy this as much as I am.